I'll just start here and kind of zig it around. Do it, do it, man. I'm going to go hit the You'll see me kind of stumbling around. Yeah. Hey guys, how you doing? Now I'm going through the main part of Barrett Jackson. This is uh, a lot of vets. We're going to work our way back out towards the front. Let me know what you want to see. Look at this. <laughs> What's up, AZ Froggy? Check that out. Hey CNC, what's up, buddy? Yeah, we're out here at Bear Jackson. What cars you want to see? I'll just keep heading around. Hey, no problem, Auto Vans. Thanks, man. Try not to get too many people. As we get up here. You guys are going to freak out when you see some of these cars. <laughs> Nomad. Oh my god. Look at that. Oh. oh, that's cool, Izzy Froggy. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm actually heading out here in just a little bit. I wanted to go around one more time here for you guys give you guys an inside view this is going to be on a video that i'm going to be making here and i got tons and tons of coverage i mean these cars are freaking priceless you guys like the movie gone in 60 seconds here let me go show you which one do you want which eleanor do you want oh this one's nasty supercharged There's another replica. GT500 KR. Keep going here. There are so many here, it is ridiculous. Sorry guys, I gotta duck down and try to get anybody else in the shots. Check these out. This is nasty. Boss 429. 69. I like the stance on this GT500. I love the rims and stuff on that. Looks absolutely amazing. Hey RV, how you doing? Appreciate you tuning in, man. Make sure you hit that like button. If you're not subscribed to me, do it. I got a bunch more, more cool stuff coming up. I'm going to make an awesome video for all this stuff, too. I told you guys I was going to show you Carol Shelby's uh, Cobra, Super Cobra, Super Snake. I will show you it here in a second. All right, this, this uh, GT350 here is actually one of the owners of Barrett Jackson. It's his car. Okay, if you're a Ford fan, check this out. Carol Shelby's. It's got a uh, twin Paxton supercharger on This thing is ridiculous. Yep, this was his personal vehicle right there. The Super Snake 427.
Oh yeah, they're clean. There's not one in here that's not. I think it was sold at a previous one when he was still alive for charity and they're gonna do it again. Here's a Ferrari, Ford versus Ferrari. Yeah, I think it was five mil. Here, let me go back over here real quick. I'll just keep going back up and down the aisles. Let's see what you guys think about that. What do you think of that? I don't care if you don't like Ferrari, that's a bad boy. It's a 488 Pista. At least that's what the sticker said. <laughs> Oh, look, you want to talk money? I mean, look down this whole row. Check this out. God, that's beautiful. Amazing how small these cars really are, though, when you're standing by them. Check out the motor in the back there. Yeah, I can live a lot of life for five million too, man. Here, let me scoot down here. You guys like Camaros? You guys like Vipers? Here's an ACR Viper. I'll come up this way and go back down. There's a whole bunch of really cool stuff in this aisle. There's a Lamborghini. Now, behind this Lamborghini is something called a Vector. It's one of one. I'll try and get you some good shots of the Vector. It's a 12 cylinder. Here is the Vector. Aeromotive Corporation is who built it. Well, they were selling uh, on a pre-show that this was one of one now. It doesn't say on the window. Either way, I know this thing is rare. There's a little Lambo for you. Yeah, maybe prototype there, AZ. Yeah, give me a couple of these. <laughs> right. This is the James Bond edition. Check that out. All right, here, let me scoot back down. I'll show you some GT500s. Or no, sorry, four GTs. Check this out. Looks like it's an 05. Hey, Harold, no problem. Check this out. I figured some people may not be able to come out here and, and take a look at this, so I figured I'd bring it to you. Look at that. These are just unreal. They're too rich for my blood, I'll tell you that. Here, let me go back down. You guys like uh, Yanko? There is an original Yanko Camaro here. It's a survivor car. I'm going to it right now. Sorry, I can't get anybody else on camera. An original Yanko, or Copo. 69 Copo Camaro. It's the real deal. Original trim. Original everything. Unmolested Copo Camaro. 427.
What do you guys think of that? I don't even know, I don't know what the price tag would be on that. Hold on. We've got a crown here. There's another Yanko Chevelle I want to show you guys. Not this one. <laughs> yeah, that's a real nice Camaro. It's all original. Had four owners in its life. This here is rare too. Actually, yeah. Action. Okay, I'm gonna start heading back out this way. Let me show you. Uh, hold on. Look at this Continental. Man, look at those darn wheels! Holy! <laughs> it's got about an eight-body trunk. You know, my boy left the two guns. It's got about an eight-body trunk right there. Cadillac right here. 59 DeSoto. Alright, I'm going to start heading back up, guys. I'll go back out. Have you guys seen the new Hummer yet? That new electric Hummer? Because they got that uh, here as well. I'm going to start heading that way. Sorry, trying to keep people out of the shot here. There's the other side of that vector. No, I hear you. It's just one of those new things. And they got all the new Ford everythings. <laughs> Everything. Oh, I can sneak over. I'll show you where they do the auction. I can't really go in there because they have to have a tag, but they were doing Automobilia earlier. Here's the actual stage of Barrett-Jackson where they do all the auction stuff. Pretty cool, huh? All right, I'll go over by the Automobilia stuff and make my way back out towards the main entrance. There's some really cool stuff out there as well. I do have a video on uh, all the Chevy and Ford and everybody's uh, offerings while they're here. Here's the official Barrett Jackson merchandise. If you're a car guy, this stuff here, man, oh, I could buy one of each and put it in my garage. Take these little bad boys out. Yeah, that mini Swamp Rat is cool. I love uh, everything that has to do with Don Garlitz. I went to his museum out in Florida. Let me get down here. Too many people. All right, I'm going to start making my way out. So bear with me for one second. Check this out. Here you go, guys. I think they forgot to build the rest of it. But it's the way of the future. All right, here we go. I'll show you that new, the new electric Hummer. where things are heading, gentlemen. You guys like C8 Corvettes? Like all that stuff? They got one of each. C8 
C8s everywhere. I'm Rod Fellows. I don't know, that's Brian Fellows, so check that out. Oh, there's Tesla. I didn't really care about them. This is the new Ford stuff here. Check this out. Centaur. <laughs> yeah. I'm 6'2 and my head is right here. That's how tall this thing is. That is an absolute beast. Sure, caramel, whatever that is. Interesting. All right, here's some standards that you guys already know, but we'll go back up this way. Dodger's display. I didn't see a super stock. I was kind of frustrated they didn't have it. Radford Racing. You guys ever seen the TRX? Oh, there's a 1320. I didn't know they had one. Heck yeah. Yeah. There's my old girl. Mine's sitting out in the parking lot. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, that's more for me. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Let me head over and show you the TRX. Have you guys seen those? It's that 707 horse uh, Ram. Let me head over here real quick. Check that out. 707 horsepower. It's actually a pretty big, beefy vehicle. You guys ever heard of Karma? Check these things out. I haven't seen a 2022 uh, Frontier. Ooh, here's a nice looking charger. Look at this fiber, carbon fiber hood. Man. That looks sweet. There's Lexus, Toyota. You guys want to see the Fords? Got the new Fords too. That's a real big truck. Here's a little bitty race car. I think I might get one of these for my 2K giveaway. Let me know which one of these banners entices you guys. I'll call this one number one. And I'll call this one number two. Drop a one or a two in the comments for which ones you guys would rather have. And whoever wins my 2K giveaway will get one of those banners. Whatever one you guys pick that you like the best is what I'll end up purchasing. And I will give it away. Look at this merchandise aisle. Everybody's liking one, okay. Here's Lexus. Not a crazy fan of them, but <coughs> Ford has a pretty good display here. They actually have drag racing on stage. It's gonna get a little loud up here, so you may not hear me, but I'll show you the new Bronco. I'll show you all that stuff. Give me one second here. Okay, here's the Bronco up here. Oh, no kidding. Yeah, 315s are a little tough. 
You gotta watch those end links. That's the new Bronco. Later, Harold. Thanks for coming in. It doesn't look bad with the big tires, but boy, with the little tires, this thing just looks so tiny. To me, it's not anything like the old Broncos were. Oh, you already put them on and still can't get the 315s? Here's the, uh, the Mach-E. This is the one that, uh, what's his name, was driving around. Oh, why is my brain shot? That dude who does all the drifting was driving this one. So much carbon fiber. The Mustang Mach-E RTR. There's a 1,400 horsepower electric Cobra. The Cobra Jet. Yeah, Ken Block. That's whose car that was. It's crazy. 1,400 horse. Electric. You got to program it, though. <laughs> Check this out. It has a big spoiler, it has, you know, all the kind of wiggles on the front. It just is. If you look at it, it's like that. Oh, they got the Mach 1 over here, too. It's going to be the same with the other car. Yeah, no kidding, that's all it is, is a big RC car. That's the Mach 1. GT500. It seems like the dual clutch didn't help at all at the track. It seemed like they, seemed like they came off the line uh, pretty sluggish compared to the power that they have. Hey guys, I appreciate you coming. Appreciate you watching. Oh, I've walked about four miles. I'm gonna put together a huge video for this. It'll be dropped uh, later tonight or tomorrow. I'll see you next time. Mopari out.